We begin tonight with developing news. Police are searching for a suspect right now who's accused of assaulting a teenager on her way to school. Investigators say he put his hand over her mouth and grabbed her. Fortunately, she was able to break free. From the Blackstone Valley Mobile Newsroom, Eyewitness News reporter Madeline Wright is live in Pawtucket. Shannon, Mike, it was right here in this school parking lot where police say a man grabbed the 17-year-old girl from behind. She says it was the same man she saw following her earlier in the day. Pawtucket police are looking for a man who put his hand over a 17-year-old girl's mouth in the parking lot of Tolman High School. I'm not sure what his motivation was. It's possible that he could do this again. Yes, that is a possibility. Police say it all started Sunday morning around 8.30. The girl was walking by herself on Broadway from her home to a sporting event at Tolman. As she was walking, she didn't notice somebody who was following her, so she periodically she would turn and look behind her. Police say the man disappeared after the girl turned west on Blackstone Avenue. Police say she may have put her headphones on to to listen to music, and that's when the man grabbed her. She elbowed the suspect in the uh, rib area, and she was able to break free of his grasp. Police say the girl went into the school to get help, but the man had run away. How is the girl doing now? Uh, yeah, obviously uh, emotionally distraught, but uh, physically uninjured. And um, but like I said, I want to give her credit for uh, for fighting back. An attack that leaves parents on edge. Sujel Victoria says she's no longer using this parking lot as a shortcut to her son's school. From now on, I'm gonna have to go the other way around instead of work, walking around here because there's a lot of crazy people out here. Pawtucket police describe the suspect as a heavy set white man in his late 20s, 5'3 to 5'5, with a gray hooded sweatshirt and white zipper, black jean shorts, white sneakers, and no facial hair. And police say if you have any idea who this suspect is, to give them a call. Live in Pawtucket with the Blackstone Valley Mobile Newsroom, Madeline Wright, Eyewitness News.